Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode with Dan, Mike, and Beer. And we're going to continue our series this month about the Doppelbox. So since it's the Lent season, like we mentioned, yep. the monks could only drink or uh, they couldn't consume solid food. So we're going to be drinking liquid bread, as they call it. So Doppelbox. So we're basically monks. That's right, yeah. man. Absolutely. Yeah. So what are we going to try today, Mike? Uh, so this is from uh, the Cloister Atal, Ataler. It is their curator Doppelbach. So I, it's one thing that you had mentioned uh, several videos ago in our Troganator mm -hmm. video, you had talked about how the Ader on the end was That's paying right. homage to the original That's right. beer, which if you watched our first video in this series, you would have seen that, the Salvatore. So this curator uh, was first brewed in 1609 by this monastery. They actually started in... 1330, wow, but didn't get history. Yeah, didn't get into the beer business until a little bit later. Uh, they probably saw how profitable it was for all the other German cloisters, and lucky for us, they that's started true. doing it. It's a cool label too. I like it. So that's a picture of their mon yeah, monastery. Yeah, that's guessing. the monastery. So if we ever make it over there, we'll just say, "Hey, have you seen this monastery? That's right. Show us where it is." Anyway, so what we should be seeing here is a very dark beer. Wow. Yeah, this um, one's really dark. With a bit of a ruby color, if yep. you look through it, which Holding you can definitely the light, see. You can definitely see some red yeah. tints to it, yeah. Not a lot of head on this. I'm not seeing a lot of bubbles in there either. Very nope. slow moving bubbles. Mm -hmm. um, and that could be because this is a thicker beer. So when we drink it, we should have a, a kind of a full mouthfeel there. All right. Um, as far as the smell, malty, mm -hmm. caramel, as you'd expect from these uh, heavily malted beers. Yeah, thinking back to the Polliner Doppelbach, this one. Smells a bit more caramel to it. Yeah, uh, I can definitely smell more grain in this yeah. one. And unfortunately, I wasn't able to find any information about the grain bill. So if you know what it is, make sure to let us know about it in the comments. But let's go ahead and take a taste. All right, prost. Prost. Oh, wow. wow, that is a much thicker beer yeah. than the really other one. Really full mouth feel, super smooth. Mm-hmm. But yeah, it just it really... Lots of sweetness on this one, too. That really filled it up. Just a little bit of bitterness, I think. Just a touch of it. Um, just a little tiny bit to offset some of the sweetness. Yeah, I think so, um, which I like. Um, and what was the ABV on this one? 9%. Woo! So yeah, that's definitely getting up there. But um, I have to tell you, I think I like this one a little bit better. That's a funny thing that you mentioned that, because when you look at some of the ratings of these Doppelbox. So Polliner, yes, they were the very first Doppelbach, mm -hmm. but they're no longer really rated as the most liked anymore. I think Interesting. one of their, I think it was Beer Advocate score or, some, or Rate Beer, it was around like upper 80s, low 90s, mm -hmm. and some of these other Doppelbachs rate you know, a lot higher than that. Yeah, and I think I would rate this beer uh, over the Polliner. Interesting. The Polliner is still good. That's the original. I'm, I'm sticking <laughs> with the original. Uh, but I, I like the... Uh, more maltiness to this beer, the thicker mouthfeel. It's just a bigger version of the Polliner. It's darker, and a little bit sweeter, a little bit maltier. It's just more little, ABV. A that's a great way. Yeah. That's a great way to describe it. A, a bigger version of the Polliner. It's good. I like it though. Yeah. These classic German beers. I'm all about. <laughs> that's right. Stuff. Yeah, and the rest of the beers we're going to be trying for this month, sticking with the Doppelbox, they're all coming from Germany. So. That's right. Make sure to join us in the future episodes. You can do that by hitting subscribe so you can get the updates right to your inbox. Make sure to hit like if you like the video. And if you had this beer or any other Doppelbox, let us know about it in the comments. Till next time, we'll see you later. All right, prost.